<clears throat> Good evening, everyone. Hello and welcome back. Another day, another video. Today, I don't have a guest with me. Uh, if you want to be a guest and read something with me, then just let me know and tell me what you want to read and we can make that happen. You know who you are. Uh, if not, we're going to continue. Now, I misunderstood what Halloween is in terms of when it is. I thought it was today, but it was actually last night. So the one I should have done last night, I'm doing today. And the one I should have done today, I've done last night. You with me? You with me? Cool. Of course you are. You know what I'm talking about. So I went and found a really, really, really cool poem. It is a kid's poem. It is a kid's horror poem mm. uh, called The Boogeyman by Jack Vrlatsky. Now, I have tried a very, I've tried very hard to get in hold of Jack Vrlatsky. Uh, I have sent him a message. I've contact, tried to contact him on Facebook, tried to find his email address, gone to his publishing site, gone to his website, gone to his publishers. I've done, and, and I get nothing. So I looked at the date of it. It was published in 1970s, in the 1970s. I don't think it's around anymore. So I hope, I, because I, I'm not getting any feedback, I'm going to assume that the company that's holding it or something like that is no longer with us or for some reason not there anymore. And uh, I'm going to try reinvigorate Jack Palatsky's work with you. I'll put a link to some of the stuff that I've been able to find. He is amazing. He is truly cool. Like the poems and stuff, I, I read them for fun. Because I'm like that. Uh, so yeah, if you want to check out his stuff, follow the link below. But without further ado, I'm going to read to you my Halloween poem called The Boogeyman. Uh, yeah, published 1976. So, this is going to be a deep one, but it's going to be fun. Here we go. In the desolate depths of a perilous place. The boogeyman lurks with a snarl on his face. Never dare, never dare to approach his dark lair, for he's waiting, just waiting, to get you. He skulks in the shadows, relentless and wild, in his search for a tender, delectable child. With his steely, sharp claws and his slathering jaws, oh, he's waiting, just waiting, to get you. Many have entered his dreary domain, but not even one has been heard from again. They no doubt made a feast for the butchering beast, and he's waiting, just waiting, to get you. In that sulfurous, sunless, and sinister place, he'll crumple your bones in his boogie embrace. Never, never go near if you hold your life dear, for oh, what he'll do when he gets you. Ha 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 ha!